they're super, super leaky, as you can see, and there will be a lot of... I chose to go into the Medical Career Pathway Program because I have always wanted to work in the medical field, and I knew that the class would be a really good way for me to gain the skills and the knowledge that will help me with a career in healthcare. We get to learn about the basics of anatomy and physiology in class, but we're also partnered with the local hospital, which gives us the opportunity to volunteer there once a week, which is a really good experience for us to see what it's like to work in a hospital setting. And another part of the class is that we get to hear presentations from health professionals, and we get to learn about their careers and the steps that they took to get them there, which is a really good way for us to learn about new careers besides just the typical like route of becoming a doctor or a nurse. Growing up, I thought that everything to do with planes and flight was like super cool. And initially, I chose uh, to join just out of um, that fascination. But as time has gone on, um, I've certainly considered it more for a career that, along with my other interests, I think that it's really just something that I enjoy and it helps me to understand a lot more about the world around us and I really uh, value that. I, uh, of course, was a freshman when we first got the av aviation program and I signed up for it then. The original class had about 10 people, I want to say, but last year and this year especially, to go from just like a handful of people to like 30 plus kids in this program, and I'm excited that there are other people going into it and I, I hope that this passion can be brought to other students as well. During the field trip to the Illinois College of Optometry, I got to hear from a couple of students about what kind of led them into optometry, and I actually got to shadow a fourth year optometry student as he met with patients in the advanced care unit, and I got to see kind of like what the day in the life of an optometrist looked like. The field trip to Lewis University was pretty fascinating, but whether it was you know, talking with uh, former United Airlines pilots, uh, engineers. The opportunity to go and fly with Mr. Russo was something I did not expect. Once we got the news that you know, we're going to go up in an actual aircraft with a, a veteran pilot, it was, a, it was a pretty big shock. And then to get the news that we were going to be behind the controls as well, to actually be in there with someone who's doing it for longer than we've been alive and to learn from someone like that, it's, uh, it was incredible. Showing up there with the other aviation students and going through that checklist with Mr. Russo, we were all just kind of excited like a bunch of little kids, like, oh my god, like we know this stuff. And it was just really great to see how what we're learning is actually being applied in the field and it's not just like you're filling your head with information you won't use. I think that the Career Pathway Program is a really good opportunity for students to hear from professionals in the field because they get to kind of see what their, the career would be like firsthand and kind of the steps that they would have to take to get them there. I think it's good to consider all possibilities with your classes. Of course you get electives and some of those can be uh, pathway programs. You know, it's not going to be the easiest thing there's going to be work that comes with it you know it's it's a class just like every other there's there's going to be work but it's a class that you can thoroughly enjoy especially if you have a uh, passion for that specific topic I, I highly encourage other people to try and learn what they can about what they're interested in and the fields around it as well so that everything can be taken into account